Hello guys, welcome to the channel. Uh, we're back at it with the Manchester United uh, career mode on Football Manager Mobile um, today. Apologies for the lack of uploads in the last three months. Obviously things have got a bit crazy, uh, but we're going to be back at it now. Uh, so welcome back to anyone that was watching the series um, back in April now. Um, here's a quick reminder of how we were getting on with the Man United career. First season, um, Sir Alex Ferguson returns. Um, so in all competitions still, uh, we've got a Carabao Cup semi-final uh, second leg against Arsenal. We are 2-0 uh, uh, up in that one, going to the Emirates to defend that and get through to the final hopefully. Second in the league um, and we've also got to the uh, next stage of the Europa League. Um, and as you can see here, um, the last episode we made a... Move four at Hammers Rodriguez. That has been accepted. And we are going to welcome him to the club. So we've got Bruno who's been in great form. Uh, but just uh, add a bit more depth to the squad. Um, and here is the squad. So we've got... Uh, da, 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 the first team coming back in. And also we... Uh, Complete the signing of uh, Vinicius Junior from Real Madrid. And uh, on loan for the rest of the season. And obviously now James. And uh, James joins us. Um, so, yeah, first things first, we're going to go straight into this um, semi final against Arsenal. Fans are jubilant about the new signing. Uh, but yeah, I've not uh, played at all in the last uh, three months, so fingers crossed, all goes well. Um, we're going to sit Rodriguez on the bench for now. Um, if we're going to give Junior a start, his first start in the cup. As you can see, he scored a hat trick on debut, so he's in good form. I think everything else. It's good to go. So the standard formation. What number do we give Hammers? I reckon a number sixteen or not going on his back. And here we go. Off to the Emirates to defend our two nil lead. And away we go. Arsenal on the attack early doors. 1-0 and it's given. I thought it might have been offside. Not the start we were after. It's all Arsenal again. Another cross. It's 2-2. Two -two. And within seven minutes our 2 nil lead has gone. 14 minutes. Right. Obviously something's not working here. Oh, there we go. Vinicius Junior. Two games, four goals. I guess it's back into it. I'm not sure on the away goal rule. Oh, we've won a penalty. Son to take. Rashford won it. Son to take. Son gets us back into the game. Gives us a lead on aggregate. That's 3-2. Five goals within the first half an hour here. Closing on half time. What a strange game we've had. Arsenal on the tack just before half time. Saka. Jesus Christ, what a game. 4-2 down at half time. Level 4-4 on aggregate. How do we change it? Quite literally, how do we change it? I forgot the button. Um... So I don't know why Lingard was... Oh yeah, we moved Bruno, didn't we? Um, I reckon... Rodriguez... I've got to come at him a little bit more, I reckon. Use the pace, use the whip we've got. Fingers crossed on second half. Corner early doors. And it's in! Bruno whips it in. There's a bit of turn and throwing, and then Pogba finishes it. 
Four three on the night, five four on aggregate. Off and out to go, Arsenal on the attack again. Nothing comes of it. We're in at James Rodriguez off the bench. The new signing makes it four all. That's six four on aggregate. Things are feeling a little bit a little bit more comfortable now. We've got the uh, leggy players on. The pitch has have a look. Eric Bailey is dropping a four, uh, four out of ten. I think we're going to bring him off. You don't drop fours out of ten for Man United, unfortunately. Arsenal with a corner. Bloody hell, Pablo Mari scores again. Bamiang away. What a save. Ten minutes now. S very tight, slender lead. Drop back a little bit. Bring Fred on. Five minutes to go. Another corner. Lacazette to take. That's dealt with into injury time four minutes added on. We're into the third of those, Pepe. Clears everyone. Just got to get it away, Son. Wins a corner. I'll throw him rather. Bumming's away. And there we are. Lose 5 4 on the night, but we win 6 5 on aggregate. What a game that was. And we go through. Not the result we uh, wanted was to lose the game and concede 5, but. Possibly the first silverware of the season. And Bournemouth, uh, we will meet in the final. Interesting. So you'd say we're pretty much hard on there, but. Um, I'll take it for granted. We've got a 5.5 .5 million offer for Romero. Second choice keeper. I think we're Lee Grant. Um, it's third choice. I think we're going to keep Romero. It's obviously not got much game time, but it's difficult when uh, David De Gea is in front of you. Leicester winning a few awards there. They must have had a decent month. In sixth place, so we play uh, Chelsea away from home now. In seventh, Liverpool must have won us with five behind them now. Two big games coming up. We've got Martial still out of the side. I think. Hammers is going to get a start for a very good performance coming off the bench. <clears throat> How did uh, Junior get on in that game? Yeah, positive. What's going on? Um, we're going to stick with the same tactics. As we're away from home again. Depending on how it goes, we might need to go a bit more attacking. If it's anything like the Arsenal game. Bright start from Chelsea. Ten minutes in. Chelsea come again. It's clear to Rashford. Two good opportunities there. But still 0-0. Had the best of it so far. We get a corner. Bruno's deadly from a set plays. Well, nothing comes of that one. Van Bissaka. And nothing comes of that one either. Rashford from range. Forces a save. Corner. Bruno to take. Into Rashford. Another opportunity for Rashford. Third time lucky. Marcus Rashford. Strike of half time. Makes it 1 0. What a strike. Great play from the boys. That changes the half time team tour. The 46th minute makes it 1 0. Chelsea come again. 
Di Maria. Must be a recent signing from. Still one nil. Just less than half an hour to go. Bailey makes a foul. Is that in the box? No. Just on the edge. Neat wall does its job and blocks that one. Right, 15 minutes to go. We're going to make a few changes. We bring Oddie on. Garno up top. Dan James on for Junior. We're going to put Son on to the left. And we're going to bring. We're going to move Bruno in behind. We're going to bring Fred on for Hammers. And hopefully we, that will just shore us up. With uh, 15 minutes to go. Be a good victory this one. Carlos through. Oh, he just puts it wide. Five minutes left. That would have uh, sealed the deal. So on, on to James. Dan James wins the corner. Bruno still on, he takes it front post. Chelsea come away with it, Di Maria. Nothing of it. I haven't really created much since the uh, early part of the game, Chelsea. And that seals it, 1 0. Good victory. Moves this back within two of Liverpool. There's Leicester lose as well. Arsenal keep up the pace with a win. And there we are. Three, so we move away a bit from Chelsea, but Man City keeping up the pressure in fifth place. Obviously, the aim is uh, Champions League football for next season. Um, but at the moment, we're keeping the pace on Liverpool. So a total challenge uh, as we move into February. We're still there, two points behind is likely, but it's going to be uh, very dependent on how this next fixture goes. Uh, Tottenham, obviously, a big challenger. For us, they've played the same amount of games, just three points behind. Um, so this is a big, big game in that title challenge. I think everyone's still fit. Bruno's looking a little bit leggy. So I'm going to play... I think I'm going to play him in behind, bring Fred in, and that way Hamez can come off the bench, I reckon, for, for now. I want Bruno to play, he's been such a great player so far this season. Um, so I think that's how we're going to line up. If Bruno's got to come off after 60, then hopefully he's made a bit of an impact in the game by them, and then we can bring Hamez on. There we go. The new White Hart Lane Stadium. Tottenham piling the pressure on Addy Doors as we counter on them. Rashford's through. Rashford makes it 1-0. It was all Tottenham there, but we broke away on the counter. I believe it was Fred that played the long ball over. And Rashford finishes it off. Much like he did against Chelsea. At Stamford Bridge. Bruno away. Pogba into Son. Pogba to Pogba. Nothing comes of it. Son to Pogba to Rushford to Pogba. We win the free kick just on the edge. Son takes. Nothing comes of it. Half an hour gone. Another chance there for Rashford. It's Tottenham break on us now. It's dealt with well. Oh. There makes a save on for, from Kane, but it comes back out to Daddy Ali, pounces and makes it 1 1. From close range, just before half time. Rashford's through. Oh, Rashford. He's getting plenty of chances, as he did against Chelsea. Only the one goal for him so far, Bruno. But Maguire fails, and uh, nothing comes of that. We've had the best of it so far at half time. But 1 1, it stands. I mean, a draw won't be the end of the world away from home, but. 
can't let them win. If we uh, want to keep the pressure on Liverpool. Ooh, chance from Son there. Playing against his former club. Deli Alley from range. Devastating. It's right, 2 1 down now. The changes have got to happen. Got to go at some. Rashford another 10 minutes if not we've got a Gala or Greenwood who can come on let's make something happen boys 20 minutes to go nothing is yet Son's injured we have to bring Lingard up so Marcus Rashford is going to play the full game so that's our first substitute. I don't like we're gonna get one. James, oh yeah, there's two players on the left they could have made the pass to. Pogba James No And that's it. Could have got the equalizer of them. And we lose. So how's that affecting Liverpool wins, so we're five points behind them and drop down to third. Tottenham leapfroggers. So we lost to uh, Arsenal, Tottenham, Man City. So three uh, losses from the last five games after that great run of form uh, from October through to the uh, start of the year. I'm running a little bit now and the games are coming thick and fast. So we've got Norwich coming in the Premier League and Palace. Then we've got Sparta Prague home and away in the first round of the Europa League. Then the final against Bournemouth in the Carabao Cup. And then we can concentrate on um, the Premier League with a tough run of fixtures last at Arsenal, Liverpool. But it's not a bad running. If you look at that last six or well, possibly even eight, you've got Watford, Wolves, Southampton, Burnley. And the final four, Brighton, Sheffield United, Villa, Newcastle. Um, so we've made it pretty much played uh, a lot of the top ten, apart from um, Liverpool, Arsenal and Leicester. Um, so we've got 13 games left, five points behind. It's still all to play for. Um, but yeah, I hope, hope you're still enjoying this series. Obviously, uh, I'm going to get back to posting um, a lot more over the next few weeks uh, try and get uh, three or four out a week for you um, and again sorry it's been such a while in between episodes um, but yeah I'll say if you have enjoyed like the video subscribe to the channel and uh, I will be back soon cheers for watching guys